Mech Knight of the Morning Star hits the TCG this Friday, and it's an excellent addition to the Mech Knight theme. It allows you to play the pure Mech Knight strategy in a competitive sense for perhaps the first time ever. And I wrote an article this past week about it, which you can check out on TCG Player. But the real cool thing about Mech Knight of the Morning Star, besides the fact that it makes pure Mech Knights playable, is that it's a great asset to World Legacy themes. If you're playing a deck like Crawler or World Chalice, this is a card that will let you search out your World Legacy cards as long as you have World Legacy discard fodder. That said, if you had Mech Knight discard fodder, which likely you do because you are playing Mech Knight monsters, you can go ahead and discard those as well. And you might be thinking, well, I play the Mech Knight engine in my decks and Mech Knight of the Morning Star seems to be a good Link 2 in those cases where I need Link 2s. And if you're playing Invoked Mech Knights, that's awesome because Mech Knight of the Morning Star has great Link arrows for your strategy. But I can't really use that first effect of search for a World Legacy card, even if maybe I would want to do that. Well, I have news for you. You can. So I see a lot of people overlooking the fact that because you're playing the Mech Knight engine, it's not hard to actually play World Legacy cards alongside it. And I would say now, assuming your deck can capitalize on it, one of the cards you'll want to play is World Legacy Succession. So I think that right now, Mech Knight engines should be adding World Legacy Succession to the deck if your deck, A, wants to play Succession in the first place because you can use its effect uh, as a free Monster Reborn, and B you're okay with actually playing the Mech Knight engine in that way. Uh, so, World Legacy Succession says the following. You target a monster in your graveyard, special summon it to a zone and like monster points to. So, if you're searching this off of Mech Knight of the Morning Star, you already have a link monster, and you have two perfectly available zones to summon your uh, extra deck monster, perhaps, to, um, or really any monster in general. And that's good for example for invoked you can just special summon a mecha buff back to the field um, there are plenty of decks that want to get a free special summon now the question is how do you do that right because you're using your mech knight for that summon but we already have a really good way to accomplish that and that's through mech knight blue sky when you summon mech knight blue sky if your opponent has cards in their column in that column you're already going to be searching at least one mech knight monster for free just combine your blue sky with whatever other monster you have, and ta-da, you now have not only Link summoned your Mech Knight of the Morning Star, but you also already have the fodder to discard to search World Legacy Succession. So now you can just discard um, you know, your other world, uh, your other Mech Knight card in this case, probably Purple Nightfall, although I think will be wanting to expand the Mech Knight lineup instead of just having Blue Sky and Purple Nightfall. I think you'll want to play maybe a couple of the other ones. Um, Yellow Star in particular, it, I'm a really big fan of. So you're already going to have a bunch of those cards right in your hand, so you discard those. Uh, then you can immediately summon back. If, and if you really wanted to, you could do that to summon back Purple Nightfall. But I don't really see the point of doing that. If you want Purple Nightfall badly, you probably won't play Succession. That said, you can, uh, um, at that point, go ahead and, and, and play Succession and target a really important monster in your graveyard. Maybe a big Link monster. Maybe something that already went to the graveyard earlier. A Link 2. Then you can make a Link 4, like Firewall. And that turns a card like Mech Knight Blue Sky, plus literally any other card in the field, as long as your opponent has a card in their column, into a, a really great avenue for Link 4s. Um, not quite Boralode necessarily, unless you have another monster to combo off with. Uh, or either that, or basically you just have a searchable monster reborn. And depending on the deck, that's super valuable, right? If you have something awesome in your graveyard that you want to special summon back, like special summon back a BLS or something crazy, even though I don't know how many decks are playing BLS and a Mech Knight engine, but you know, you bring back World Legacy Succession, uh, or you, you use that to bring back like an Arctal or Christia, which is the card that always comes to mind whenever I think about what are good Monster Reborn targets? What are good Special Summon targets from the graveyard? Okay, so that's kind of what I wanted to talk about. I think it's cool. I think this card, uh, Mech Knight of the Morning Star, it's, it's, I, I, again, I wrote a whole article about it on Pure Mech Knights. I think it's good beyond Pure Mech Knights, and that's where 
this card is going to see a lot of success, even be even besides the fact that it's a good link too with good arrows that you can make with really easy conditions because you're already getting like tons and tons of free mech knights from your mech knight engine. So I like it. I think it's I think it's cool, uh, and I think we'll see some people be playing it this year. So uh, shorter video. Let me know what you think, and let me know about your comments and if you're gonna be playing Mech Knight of the Morning Star yourself. Thank you for listening, and until next time, then.